Hey guys, welcome back to our new episode. How many of you here hate drinking milk? I know most of you do. You are in luck, people. I just got the perfect use for the milk you do not want to drink. So, pour all of that milk into a beaker and add the potassium permanganate crystals to it. Yes, I know it just turned brownish and nothing else is happening, but just give it some time. Patience is a virtue. Now watch. Notice the milk starts bubbling. Now, you want to step back a little because this is not going to get pretty. So, what's happening here is a neutralization reaction. We know that in neutralization reaction, acid and bases react with each other to form water and salt. The same way potassium permanganate as a base reacts with the lactic acid present in milk to form potassium lactate and water. All right, so let's try something else. I'm sure all of you will have antiseptics and disinfectants lying around the house. So I have Dettol here. What about you? If Dettol isn't available in your region, just look for a disinfectant that has chlorhexylenol in it. Cool? Okay, take some of the disinfectants in a beaker and add potassium permanganate to it. The reaction starts almost immediately and you can see it bubble its way out of the beaker. Oh my god, this is one more violent than the milk. Even though the liquid has bubbled over, the reaction still goes on with whatever is left in the beaker. There isn't a lot of brown here like from our previous experiment. The bubbles and water vapor that you see in the beaker is an exothermic reactor, which is a result of the two compounds. All right, guys, that was all for today. It was crazy. It was fun. Make sure you like, subscribe and comment to our channel. Bye.